Hello and welcome back to channel Tea Lover. So if you are new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel and also do not forget to click on our bell icon for our latest update. So as you all know that we are making video regarding how to create a free domain hosting and free watch our views and subscribe for our YouTube channels also. Okay. So there are a lot of useful content in my channel. Please go through them. And if you need the free traffic for your website, then there are many methods to get the free traffic on your website using the bot traffic, social traffic or direct traffic on your website, which will help you to get the approval of AdSense on your website beside all this if you have any problem related to any monetization and ads and error on your youtube channel or website then then you can directly make a contact with me in tilawa2054 in the instagram as i have shown in the screen please contact me through this medium so that i can help for you so in the topic of today we are getting the free dot me domain and free azure account over here using the free dot edu mail over here so first of all before logging to this github student development pack i want to share you that how you can get the free edu mail for this login over here okay so let's begin this video without skipping let's go for it so i like to tell you that recently i got my channel terminated so if you are a new viewer then please subscribe and if you are old viewer also then please get subscribe back to my channel and get connect with me okay so let's begin so first of all you have to just go for the new tab of chrome or any browser you may like and you have to just type for the you have to type for the Arizona ASU as I have shown in the screen. So just type this one and go for the link and you will find the first option over here Arizona State University. Just you have to go for it. We will get this .edu mail from this university. Okay. So here you have to fill up some information. So please do not skip any part. Then if you miss something then you will not .edu mail. I will show you the proof also that this is 100% working one. Okay. After a bit scrolling down, we can find a apply now option over here. So just click on the apply now. And finally, again, we have to go for the OK, I agree and just scroll down and we'll again find the ASU application over here. So just click over it. We'll redirect to the form from which we will apply for this university. So here we have to create an account. And one thing I want to tell you that do not skip this video because you will not able to get this dot edu mail without these guidelines okay so first of all you need to add your first name last name and other information over here so for that you have to use the fake address over here so to get the fake address you have to just go for the new tab again and you have to go for the website that is f a k e fake and you have to add x y over here and just go for the enter and you will find the fake address generator website over here just go for it and in this website you have to just go for the all countries close this ad scroll down and you will find the united state over here so just click on the united state okay finally the fake address is display over here so first of all we need the fake name over here so it's full name so here it is the name and gender so from that this gender is male so just copy the name now we'll paste in that same state over here so just paste over here so this is the first name and we'll just paste the last name over here so this one is optional do not go for it and we have to go for the date of birth so finally we have just entered the date of birth of this person okay so we need the email but here you have to enter your own email in which you want to get the dot edu mail over here okay so here after keeping your mail you have to just go for the password so in this password form you can create your password over here but there are some password requirement over here so to create the password you have to just go for the password requirement and you have to create a password over here using this symbol over here so you cannot use at the rate over here okay so you have to use this password using this special symbol over here okay so we'll just go for the creating a password over here so for example you can create a password like this this is the name of this person so you have to use the password like this this symbol one and you can just use the random number over here so like this you should use the password to get login in this website okay so after creating your password just go for the start my application so one thing i want to tell you that after clicking on this uh, next you have to wait for some time do not get panic it will automatically reload over here as you can see in the screen okay so just go for the legal name this is the already we have filled over here so this is the last name so there is no suffix over here we'll just leave all this over here okay we will not fill up the optional we'll just fill up the compulsory one so now we have to add the home address so let's check the address over here so as the person is from united state we will go for the united state so here is the address line one for address line we have to just go for the fake address generator and you can find the address over here so this is the address copy this paste over here 
सो वील लुक फॉर द सीट इज सो हेर इज द सीट इज ब्लैक वुड ब्लैक वुड सो जस्ट वील कॉपी दिस ब्लैक वुड एंड वील पेस्ट ओवर यार सो वील गो फॉर द स्टेट सो जस्ट सिलेक्ट द न्यू मेक्सिको ओवर यार ओके आई विल गो फॉर द पोस्टल कोड सो कॉपी देखो पोस्टल कोड फ्रॉम हेयर पेस्ट ओवर यार सो इन दिस मोबाइल नंबर यू डू नॉट हैव टू फील एनी थिंग ओवर यार सो जस्ट गो फॉर द फोन नंबर ओके क्लिक ऑन द फोन नंबर एंड यू कैन फाइंड दिस फोन नंबर ओवर यार सो जस्ट कॉपी दिस फोन नंबर लाइक दिस वी हैव जस्ट पेस्ट आवर फोन नंबर ओवर यार नाउ विल स्क्रोल डाउन वी कैन लीव दिस ऑप्शनल दिस वन इज ऑल्सो ऑप्शनल विल गो फॉर द सेक्स ओवर यार सो यू हैव टू जस्ट चूज द मेल और फीमेल ओवर यार सो आवर पर्सन इज मेल जस्ट क्लिक ऑन द मेल यार इन दिस ऑप्शन यू हैव टू जस्ट गो फॉर द लास्ट वन नॉन ऑफ दिस ऑप्शन अप्लाई टू मी एंड आफ्टर दैट एंड आफ्टर दैट यू हैव टू जस्ट क्लिक ऑन आई एम और यू एस सिटीजन ओवर यार ओके सो कंट्री ऑफ बर्थ वी हैव टू जस्ट सिलेक्ट द कंट्री ऑफ बर्थ दैट इज यूनाइटेड स्टेट यार यू नीड द सोशल सिक्योरिटी नंबर एस एस एन नंबर सो फॉर दैट यू कैन फाइंड दैट एस एस एन नंबर ओवर यार ओके सो दिस इज द सोशल सिक्योरिटी नंबर ओवर यार यू कैन नॉट पेस्ट दिस सोशल सिक्योरिटी नंबर सो यू हैव टू मैनअली टाइप ओवर यार जीरो एट सिक्स टू टू वन सेवन ओके वी हैव जस्ट टाइप दी सोशल सिक्योरिटी नंबर मैनुअली सो डू नॉट कॉपी एंड पेस्ट ओवर यार यू हैव टू यूज द मैनुअल टाइप ऑन दिस एस एस एन नंबर ओवर यार ओके सो जस्ट गो स्क्रोल डाउन सो लिव ऑल दिस ऑप्शन एज इट इज सो स्क्रोल डाउन एंड यू हैव टू जस्ट गो फॉर दी आई हैव नेवर एफिलेट टू एरिजोना स्टेट यूनिवर्सिटी एंड यू हैव टू गो फॉर दी स्क्रोल डाउन एंड प्राइमरी लैंग्वेज स्पोकन एट होम सो दैट्स इंग्लिश सो जस्ट सिलेक्ट द इंग्लिश ओवर यर एंड यू हैव टू इंटर दी पेरेंट्स नेम ओवर यर सो वी डू नॉट नो दी नेम ऑफ दैट पर्सन गार्जियन सो जस्ट यू कैन यूज एनी नेम ओवर यर यू जस्ट क्रिएट दी रैंडम नेम ओवर यर सो आई जस्ट यूज दी मैरी यू कैन यूज जेरी एनी थिंग यू लाइक ओके Your last name should be same as that person, so that this is the waiver. So finally, is this person living? So just select the no. Relationship, go for the grandparents and highest education degree. So just go for the high school and did the guardian attend ASU? No. So finally, this is done. Look this once that I have filled over here, and next one will just go for the down and will go for the additional parents legal guardian. So we'll just add the James. You can use any male name over here. So use the same last name. So whoever is this person living, we'll just go for the no relation that is grandparents, and we'll go for the high school. Again, we'll go for the no. So finally, after filling up this, we have to go for the save and continue. So it will take time. Do not get panic. Within two three minute, it will automatically reload over there. So as you see that it is reloading, a new page will be open over there. So finally, next my school option also is available over here. Now we have to go for the select the country that is United States, and in the state you have to just go for the New Mexico that is of same person. So here is the New Mexico of that person. As you see that this is the New Mexico. Now we'll go for the city, and that city is we'll check the city. It's Blackwood. So we'll go for the selecting the Blackwood over here. So in this city, select the respective city as they have shown in this fake address. But if you do not have that respective city, then you can choose any city of that New Mexico over here. Okay. So this is New Mexico, and we'll select this buyer. So as we have no that black wood in this city over here. Okay. So we'll just go for the high school, and you can select the any high school over here. We have just made some modification on the city, and we'll just select the high school. You can just select your high school as you like. Okay. So we'll just go. For For the this one, and we have to choose the graduation date. For this graduation date, you have to just select the October, or you can go for the September over here. Okay, so just click on the October, and in this year, just enter the 2000. Do not enter anything else over here. Okay, enter the graduation year below than 2011. So after that, what is the name printed on the transcript? So you have to just click on the Ricky Weber. You have to click over here, and you have to just click on the Done. Now on the next option, have you previously attended or are you currently attending a college or university? We will go for the option and we will just click on the I have never attended a college or university. So click on the save and continue. So it will take time. Do not get panic. And next page has been loaded over here. So in this option, you have to be very careful. First, you have to click on the S yes and you have to just click on the No. Okay. Our next page will reload like this. So in this next page, you have to just go for the permanent home. So you have to select your state. So that is New Mexico of that 
person so you have to just click on the save and continue wait for a while so choose a major over here so in this option you have to just click on the non degree over here and you have to select that please select the campus you like to attend so here you have to search select the online because you do not have to go for the any campus over here so just click on the online you want to take the online classes over here and in this section you have to just select the first option over here so you have to go for the 2023 spring season b you have to select the respective which one is on the top of this option okay so just click on this 2023 spring season b and just click on the save and continue before that i want to tell you that please confirm that this you have select the online on this option over here okay so just click on the save and continue so it will take one or two minutes to reload over here okay after getting verified you will reload it to next page over here so finally we are on the last option over here on the review we have to just check over here that our information is correct or not so after going for it you can find that our transcript has been missing over here okay so just scroll up you can find all things done but this transcript has been missing so for that we have to just click on the edit so over here you have to just go for the edit option over here you can find the option the name printed on transcript so just click on the ricky weber and click on the done and finally go for the save and continue so we'll go for the next page just go for the save and continue now we have already filled up this form again we'll go for the save and continue so in this page also we'll go for the save and continue so here the missing information has been successfully gone over here okay so you can find this name on transcript that is ricky weber that is printed over here so our problem has been solved so if you got the same problem you can just go for the edit and you can edit this section like this so after doing this you have to just go for the i agree and you have to solve the recaptcha and this is the final layer one just click on the submit my application so after some second you will be reloaded to our next page on this last option to get this edu free github developer pack now we are in the payment method over here so in this payment method we can skip this part okay so there is option that pay later we have to pay 70 dollar but we do not need any virtual credit card to pay over there okay so just click on the pay later and click on the submit my application so finally application has been submitted so after submitting the application we will get the mail from this arizona after some hour so that might be 12 hours to 24 hours as i have done this work before i'll just show you the proof over here i received the mail over here so i haven't opened this mail also so i have received this mail just four hours ago over here as you see over here and we'll go for the login id over here okay so after mail you have to just go for the i have read and agree the term and condition you have to just go for the check option and you have to just go for the continue so here in this activation link you need the last name of your family and date of birth of that person and social security number that i want to tell you that if you have used this fake address over here so do not close this tab just go for the right click and save as and you can directly save total page that you need further verification to this website okay so make a screenshot or keep this fake address with you very safely over here okay i have already saved this information so for that we will go for this that information so you have to save this information for your further use this fake address one so this is the last name of this person i'll just copy this and we'll go for the date of birth of this person so for that date of birth we have to just go for the same page check for the date of birth here i have just entered the same information that i have entered before so just we'll click on the submit so we have to choose your new password for this so for that password we can use this character over here as i have already told you so finally after setting our password we'll go for the forwarding email is this so just copy this forwarding email so just paste over here and we'll go for the confirm setting so our request has been processing so we'll just make some passion over here so this is our edu mail over here so this mail will be just forwarded to tilabar2054 at the gmail.com so this is how you can get this free edu mail on your website to get the free github developer pack on your website okay so this is how you can go for it so as you see that 
this is the github student pack and you need the and you need the edu mail to get this pack and you can get this edu pack like this so if you like this video please hit on the like of subscribe further to click on the subscribe and if you got any problem related to this topic then you can directly make a contact to me in tlover2054 in the instagram as i have shown in the screen so tlover official channel like share and subscribe will value our support thanks for watching this video thank you